Hi guys, so um, if you watched my what I got for Christmas video, the um, stationery edition, you will have seen that, that I um, shared these two um, diaries um, with you guys and I said if you'd like to see more of them then let me know and I'll do a video and a couple of you did so I thought I would share them with you. Um, they are very very similar um, and they're similar but they're different if you know what I mean. The um, So the Earth Pathways Diary is more of a UK one and that's been going, this is the 10th anniversary one um, and the Wee Moon one the gear rhythms for women um this is an american edition like um i mean they have contributors from around the world but it's made in america like the editing team are in america so it has more of an american bias to it and this one has been going for 30 30 years um so yeah they're kind of similar but kind of different as well so as you can see the earth pathways one that is spiral bound and the ween moon um has got the uh, traditional kind of like a book cover my mind's gone blank <laughs> um so yeah a few little differences um so let's start by having a look at this one this is the earth pathways one um a friend of mine very kindly um sent this to me um and it's kind of like very much inspiring you to kind of get back in touch with your um kind of spirituality and connection with the earth and the moon and um all of that kind of thing and it's very bright it's very colorful it's full of lots of different um artists that contribute and they contribute um visually as well as um, written as well so just an introduction um talk a little bit about the festival pages how to use this diary um because it's got in here this one is all based on gmt and bst and it's got like all the moon phases and retrogrades and all of that kind of in there so it just sort of talks you through that a little bit about um the moon through the zodiac signs phases of the moon the retrograde planets a bit of numerology there it talks about 2018 and what's so special about 2018 and then we go into the diary itself so there isn't that much in the form of like introduction um so each week is basically takes the same format um you've got this absolutely beautiful like graphic at the top um and it's little spaces and you each week you have um it's a week per page and each week you have like um some art or a poem or some writing for you to kind of inspire you and all that kind of thing so every single week takes the same format as you can see like so i'll just give you a quick little um flippity fl flip through so you can see all the different things in there and it's really beautiful some beautiful illustrations in there and some lovely poems and things i haven't i've had a quick flick through like this but i haven't gone through each week because i want to kind of like you know take each week as it comes and absorb it and read it and um and take it on um if you like to use a planner with for lots of things like to-do lists and um, things like that and it's probably not for you for in terms of a planner because you don't have that much room to write but um, the same with the other one I think it's really nice to um, use as like a like a little one line diary like a little one line gratitude journal or something like that um, but yeah it's got some really useful information you've got your full moons your sun rises so your moon rise and your moon sets um, has got your sunrise and your sunset up the top there but in the days it's got your moon set and everything so yeah it's a really really beautiful beautiful diary and um yeah really really love that and again this one is so very similar so it's really hard to um to say like i don't have a favorite at this moment in time um john bought me this one he um well, we both watch um, Barefoot Five and we follow them on various social media avenues. And um, he watched a video where the lady from Barefoot Five 
um, was talking about this. Apparently her, her mother has used this diary for years and recommends it. And so he knows how much I like diaries and this kind of thing. And he bought it for me. Uh, this one has more information at the very start of the book. Um, but it is quite heavy going. Um, not It's not a put you off thing. It is just definitely um, just a little bit more heavy going. So the, it talks about the different... Um, uh, why they call it Wee Moon, and that's basically for women, um, and why and why it's what it is, what the what the gear rhythms are, and everything, um, how to use the book. So it does tell you that because it's in America, it tells you how to calculate into BST or GMT. Um, like the other book, it tells you about how to use the book. So you've got like your moon phases and your retrogrades, or information, all that. That's done, bought by more of like a, like a key symbol. Um, and they just kind of talk you through all of that. Then it goes into more kind of um, where the other books, where the other one stops kind of there. This one then kind of starts with some information about the year. So we've got an astrological overview. Um, and it talks about constellate with the moon. Um, it's there. A bit more about different phases of the moon, etc. The moon card. So this again has got lots of different contributors. Some of it's like, as I said, like um, information, and some of it is um, poems or information. This is talking about the moon card in tarot. You've got your eclipses, instruction to the astro glances, um, herbs to enhance psychic abilities. Twenty eighteen, the, the year of the Earth dog. Wisdom in a teacup article. So yeah, it's just various different like articles and things. Introduction to holy days. Introduction to the theme La Luna. And then we do get into them into it soon. So more about the moon, like sort of like odes to the moon. And then we're into the um, the diary. And it's this one. This Earth Pathways one started at the first of January. Um, this or that the first yeah first January. This one actually starts the week beginning of when the winter solstice was um which obviously makes sense and um yeah it goes on very very similarly so you've got your diary bits here and then you have your little um your poems and your artwork for each week so i'll just um so every page is kind of like set out the same but then um throughout the book they do have like these larger pages as well um beautiful artwork so there yeah, we've got a bit, bit of a bigger bigger contribution there so yeah as you can see it's very very similar but also very different um i can't give you any opinions yet on which i think is the better if one of them is the better i cannot do that because it's right at the very beginning of january and i just started using it um so I've enjoyed reading all the like ditties and everything in here so far. Um, again, I've literally with this book, I've only read up to where the year starts because I want to save all of these things to read throughout the year. I've just kind of flicked through. So some gorgeous, gorgeous artwork in here. Gorgeous artwork. This one does have a little bit of a bigger space if you want to write. Sorry, I've just noticed my nails are really badly chipped. Sorry about that. Um, th so it does have a little bit bigger space to write if you want to use it as an actual, an actual diary. Um, this is slightly, slightly bigger, but that's because the Earth Pathways has got the whole entire week on one page, whereas this one has got Monday to Friday on one page and Saturday and Sunday on the other, so it makes it just a little bit bigger for you. Um, so if you don't have much to do, like, you know, you probably could use this one a little bit more as a day planner. Um, I, I, for me, I... I don't know, I do kind of like my pages quite, um, like quite, I don't know, quite plain. I don't know. Like sometimes I find a little bit of this a little bit cluttered, but then I really like the information on it, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how I'm going to use the pair of them, I, and, and my other planner. I haven't kind of thought that through. 
um, but I'm not overthinking it. I am an I am a terrible overthinker. So I'm kind of just leaving it open and I'm sure the answer will come to me at some point as to how I want to use both of these beautiful books. Or I may just read them, you know, use them as information books and just enjoy reading um, reading the offerings for each week. So I hope you've just enjoyed that little, little bit of a look further at them. Um, sometimes when you're like looking for a diary of this kind of thing, it's difficult to know what they're like when you're buying them online. It's nice to see, have a look inside. So yeah, there we go. Let me know if you've got these uh, or have used them in the past and how you use them. Do you use them as a diary or do you kind of do what I'm sort of thinking of doing, which is just using them as an information book? Oh, I haven't got this far. I have not got this far, you guys. That's exciting find. Um, the monthly spreads, they are absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Um, and this one is A5. So if you had an A5, like file of facts, you could remove these pages and kind of punch them in. They are beautiful. The artwork on those are absolutely stunning. Oh, well, that was a little find with you guys. I love that. Hmm. See, I was going, not trying to go through because I didn't want to like ruin it all for myself. And then I found these little, these little gems. Look, and then you've got a 2019 planner at the back. Oh, there's those are all the contributors. I wonder if this has got anything like that in the back. Huh. It's got some note pages. 2019. Let's glance there. Oh, this has got more stuff in the back. Well, there you go. Look, constellation. Well, the moon phases oh here we go so you've got the um your monthly spread but it's the um moon phases doesn't that look so cool like that that's pretty darn cool what here? stuff i don't understand planetary ephemery don't really understand all that Oh my goodness so yeah and those are all the contributors right <laughs> so there you go guys that's a, a little look at these two these two diaries